Oh, hey, folks. It's uh, very early in the morning right now, 727 to be precise. And um, I want to show you something. You know, a lot of people come to this channel, they get really, really mad at me because we have a lot of people that come to this channel who think they're real smart, and I continue to insist that they're not smart at all, but they're convinced, and oftentimes people tell them how smart they are, they're not smart at all. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you this article, and you can make of it what you will. Okay, this is called The Science Behind Why People Think They're Right When They're So, So Wrong. And that uh, helps you. The so, so, so is stressing how important it is. Okay, that's to help you people that are a little slower there. Um, science behind why people think they're right when they're so, so wrong. That helps you to understand the magnitude of this. Okay, there may be a psychological reason why some people just aren't wrong in an argument they're confidently wrong. According to a study published Wednesday in the journal PLOS One, it comes down to believing you have all the information you need to form an opinion even when you don't. This is you people, obviously. And then you get mad when I come out and I remind you of it. Quote, our, ba our brains are overconfident. They can arrive at uh, a reasonable conclusion with very little information, said Angus Fletcher a professor of English at Ohio State University who co-wrote the study. Fletcher, along with the two psychology researchers, set out to measure how people make judgments about situations or people based on their confidence in the information they have, even if it's not the whole story. And then it says, quote, people leap the judgment very quickly, he says. Now, how do you know about this. How do you know that you're a zombie and that you don't understand anything and that you are going to get mad at me when you come to this channel uh, and not subscribe because you're too smart? Let's say you have a pokety poke and let's say they claim that this is well researched or they say that there's a lot of research and other things testing. You take that as something that should be uh, respected. Um, if it's being funded by the people who are pushing this, and if there's a financial reward for having you required to take it, these are things that you have to uh, analyze in your brain, and you're not capable of it because you've got that easy out. And the easy out is a one-size-fits-all. You're a conspiracy theorist. And th that works really, really good. Now, I'll tell you a situation uh, where that uh, actually does work, and that is the people that are saying that, that these um, hurricanes are manipulated uh, and guided, I, I just can't go along with that. I can't. Um, th these are magnificent, huge storms, and I just don't see how they are doing it if they are controlling it. So in some cases, you do have to say, well, and you know, I looked at Redacted today and I told you to be careful with Redacted, that channel. And he's got the blurb up there saying that they're controlling uh, the hurricanes and they've got proof. So, you know, be careful for that because you know what he is. That guy, whatever his name is, a very good looking guy, but a lot of people are suing him right now, uh, unrelated to his channel. He has sketchy business arrangements, and uh, he married a you know a young leftist girl, and I forget what his name is. Um, it's not important. He's alcoholic too, uh, self-admitted, and um, I forgot his name now. But it's most important that when you come here to this channel, remember, you're going to be called not smart, even though you think you're smart yourself. As you come here and you subscribe, you're going to get smart. Because we look at the whole picture here, or more, and you know, than just most people do. And you know, you can see this. If you ever look at those Anatoly um, weightlifting things, where that guy is the actual world champion weightlifter, and he, uh, he can lift like twice his body weight, and he looks like a little nothing. It's a little Ukrainian guy, and he's like one of the 
one of the uh, strongest men in the world for his weight class within the top 12 percent and he goes over with a you know with a, a terrible looking set of clothes and sandals and and he sees people that are men usually and some women that are uh, lifting weights and you know he starts telling them that they're doing it wrong and that he wants to try it and the people are just like you they're moronic they don't understand one thing they're just zombies they do what they're told to do and believe that limited scope of information he doesn't look like anything and then what happened i mean he doesn't look like anything he doesn't look like anything and then what happens is the people are quite shocked when he lifts the weight why because their brains are so focused on being morons and uh, zombies. They just believe what's told to them. Anyways, folks, I wanted to show you that early in the morning. And uh, I am um, busy in my pursuit of trying to make money today. So take care, and I will see you later when I get out of work. Bye.